Hi everyone, welcome to another video in our series on managing and maintaining your Kyocera Task Alpha MFPs. In today's video, we will begin the process of creating a scan to folder destination. The first step in this process is to create the shared folder that you wish to scan to. Now, it is quite possible that this folder already exists. I would reach out to your IT administrator if you have one, and they may be able to point you in the direction of a scan folder that you can use. Now, if you need to create your own, for whatever reason, the first thing we have to do is we have to create the folder that we'll be scanning to. And this is done from your local workstation. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing I would like to do is I would like to, in an ideal world, I will put my scan folder at the root of the C drive. This makes uh, the process for setting up the scan folder via SMB protocol very painless. So I will open up my file explorer and then I will go to the OSC drive and then in here I will right click, select new and then folder and I will call this scans. Now that I've created the folder I need to give it sharing rights. So I'll right click on the folder in question, go to properties and then in the properties dialog that prompts I'll go to the sharing tab. Now there's a blue button here that allows me to share it. I would like to give everyone read write access. Essentially what this is doing is that the copier is going to have to essentially check in with your computer before it can put documentation in that folder. And by sharing the folder we're essentially allowing that transaction to happen. Now that we have shared the folder we'll click done here and then we will hit close. Now this folder has been shared and is now ready to be scanned to from the Kyocera Task Alpha interface which I will be detailing in another video. Today we covered how to create a shared folder for scan to SMB as it relates to Kyocera Task Alpha MFPs. My name is Sam Hammond, lead product trainer here at Boston Document Systems. Thank you for joining me and have a great day.